How cool will it be to have a vehicle that can seamlessly drive from the paved road into a lake, cross a river or cruise along the coastline like a motorboat? Turns out such amphibians are not only in possession of special agents, they could actually be bought. Today we'll be reviewing hybrid amphibious transport that is fun, practical in use, and simply awesome. Do not forget to hit that subscribe button to stay informed about the latest releases and enjoy the ride or the cruise, depending in which form your amphibian is. Amphi Cruiser This vehicle was designed by Dutch Amphibious Transport to perform equally good in any environment, be it the highway, off-road terrain or even water. It is available in three modifications, Rescue, Worker and Adventure. While the first two are made for flood rescue missions and commercial use, the Adventure is the ultimate exploration tool that can take your company of five to the edge of the world. Amphi Cruiser is based on Toyota Land Cruiser, but it has aluminum, fiberglass and chrome steel construction for better durability and waterproofing. The vehicle is offered with two diesel, one petrol and one electric powertrains, a partial four-wheel drive system and a 100-horsepower Almorin jet for water propulsion. On the road, it can develop the maximum speed of 87 miles per hour, but when moving through water, its speed drops to 5.6 mph. Argo Aurora XTV Argo is the Canadian side-by-side -side manufacturer that specializes in creating truly all-terrain capable vehicles that can even travel on water. The company produces a variety of models that are used for leisure, mining, agriculture operations and rescue missions. One of them is Aurora, an 8x8 amphibious vehicle series that includes five models and was fully redesigned in late 2018. In addition to a new and improved body construction, the Aurora now comes with new ergonomics, featuring left-hand steering and more cockpit room. It also gets comfier seats for four passengers, steel or aluminum rims, and 25-inch low-pressure tires that have custom pedal designed for riding on water. Depending on the modification, the new Aurora comes with a 30 or 40 horsepower V twin engine, Admiral High Torque transmission, and a specially developed Argo Progressive dual rate steering system. Tinger Track Tinger is a manufacturer of all terrain vehicles with 10 years of experience based in the Russian Federation. If you have ever dreamed of owning a personal tank, this company can build one for you. Moreover, their ATV will be able to replace five different vehicles at the same time. The Tinger track is ready to operate as a snowmobile, a tractor, a quad bike, a swamp buggy, or even an amphibious vessel. Available engines are sourced from Cherry SQR and come in two modifications, a 600cc two-cylinder with 35 horsepower or an 812cc three-cylinder with 57 horsepower output. The Tinger is sold in three models, all of which can operate under extreme weather conditions and are able to overcome 1.65 feet obstacles, 3.3 feet wide pits, and 45 degree inclines, riding on tough steel tracks at the max speed of 22 miles per hour. Mini Moke Ludovic Lazarus is the mastermind behind this French automotive company that specializes in designing and manufacturing of custom vehicles. From beastly looking motorcycles to amphibious retro cars, the likes of the Mini Moke. This hybrid of a car is based on the original Moke, which was produced back in the day by the British Motor Corporation as a part of the initiative to turn the Mini into an off roader. On land, the car is powered by a 400cc single cylinder Euro 4 compliant engine that outputs 19 horsepower, can ensure 56 mph top speed, and has 4x4 wheel drive for all terrain capability. In the water, though, the 1 kW electric motor can only propel the vessel forward with 2.5 miles per hour velocity. Due to its low power, the Moke is recognized as a quad cycle and a dinghy, which actually lifts licensing requirements in many jurisdictions. Bicycle. This is the world's first amphibious vehicle that combines the features of a motorcycle and a personal watercraft. Unlike many of its counterparts, the Bicycle is a true speedster regardless of the area of operation. It makes 80 mph on the highway and 37 mph or 32 knots on water. The one-seater motorbike powered by a two-cylinder 55-horsepower engine transforms into a jet ski with Gibbs Custom Dual Jet Propulsion Technology 
in just 5 seconds. Even though real-life scenarios when one might require a vehicle that is a maxi scooter during the day and a jet ski on the weekends are rather unrealistic, this fact does not mean that the Gibbs by Ski Hybrid should not exist. For starters, the necessity to own a truck and a jet ski trailer goes away. Gibbs Quad Ski The original Quad Ski was released by Gibbs back in 2012 as a one-seater ATV watercraft hybrid, and back in the day, it took the community of adventurers by storm. Later on, it was followed up by a two-seater XL version that lets you have fun with a partner and does not compromise on the performance due to the larger weight. The vehicle is brought into motion by a powerful and fuel-efficient engine borrowed from a BMW K1300 motorbike that outputs 140 horses. The quad ski can go as fast as 45 miles per hour, both on land and on water, and transforms into and from a marine form in 5 seconds. Besides being just an awesome vehicle to have fun both at sea and off-road, the amphibian will be ideal for coast and lifeguard duties, when a patrol on the beach could turn into a rescue or a pursuit mission in a single moment. If you're a fan of strange vehicles with unusual capabilities, consider watching more videos on our channel. The links with suggestions will be waiting for you in the description. Hydra Track This is a Tennessee-based manufacturer of multipurpose vehicles that can handle off-road environments and float in deep water, accessing the wildest and the most remote areas on our planet. The company's vehicles are used in the US and all over the world for business, recreation, and even managing consequences of natural and industry-related disasters, such as floods, hurricanes, and oil spills. They are sold under two brands, the original Hydro Track and the Land Tamer that was acquired from PFM Manufacturing in 2016. In total, these lineups include eight amphibious vehicles and two trailers that tried on sophisticated rubber track systems or all-terrain tires. The models have a land speed of 15 miles per hour and the water speed of 4 mph and come equipped with a fuel-efficient and reliable turbocharged diesel engines netting from 44 to 85 horses. Fibian This is one of the largest commercial high-speed amphibians on today's market that by the lens criteria is considered a truck or a bus and a rather large boat by the sea standards. The Fibian is powered by two turbo diesel V8s that output 250 horsepower each, have four-wheel drive capability, and power proprietary twin Gibbs water jets in the marine form. The vehicle is capable of 70 miles per hour highway speeds and will do 30 miles per hour at sea. It can carry up to 12 passengers and three crew, or 3,300 pounds of payload if in cargo mode. Unless you are running a water taxi business or regular efficiency, the Fibian won't make it to your garage but it will definitely be appreciated on the rescue missions and criminal pursuits, since the transition between the operation modes takes just 10 seconds. Iguana Yachts Iguana Yachts is the French manufacturer of luxurious amphibious boats that currently has five models in their lineup. The company's most all-terrain capable vessel is Expedition, a 5 c rugged boat that is equipped to conquer four feet waves, and travel on sandy or rocky beach terrain. The model comes with several powertrain options, a gasoline engine or an electric motor for traveling on land, and one or two outboard engines netting 300 and 400 HP. When traveling on water, it can develop the 46 mph top speed, while on land its capabilities are much more modest, with a maximum speed of 7 mph. Though none will argue that this iguana is not a true amphibious vehicle, we will have to admit that it feels much more comfortable in the water. Water Car Panther This Californian company was founded in 1999 and has since developed three amphibious prototypes, registering 27 technology patents in the process. In 2013, the water car began production of their first commercial model. Claimed to be the fastest and the most fun to drive water vehicle in the world, the Panther develops the maximum speed of 65 miles per hour on land and 45 miles per hour on water. It is powered by a 3.7 liter V6 from Honda, paired with a proprietary transaxle that powers the rear wheels or vehicle's jet water propulsion system. The Panther has two modifications a complete custom and a turnkey minus, and the latter one can be licensed to use on highway in some jurisdictions. It is also offered as a fire rescue watercraft that requires only 3 seconds to transition from land to water 
and is the U.S. Coast Guard approved. Did we miss any of the awesome amphibious vehicles that exist today? And how did you like the presented models? Leave your suggestions and feedback in the comments below. We cover lots of unusual vehicles on our channel, so do not hesitate watching more videos by following the links displayed on the screen. Subscribe to Armor of Territory, and may the torque be with you!